Hey. Meets me, Thomas again. And, uh, social media has been amazing. Because, you know, it's social media. And I ignore all haters. But on social media, on one certain social media, I got so many likes and uh, comments on the putting away dishes. As you can see, you can't really see it that well, but there it is. Right, right there. Clean dishes. I'm about to show you how to put them away. Let's get started. All right, so if you want to do dishes, put, put away dishes, as I'm trying to say. You gotta make sure they're dry. Because if they're not dry, they're gonna be wet. You put them away wet, it's gonna be a whole mess. You got soggy wood. You got other wet dishes, and then you have to like struggle. That and it just makes it look weird. You have a problem with that? Probably probably shouldn't watch this video. This, this knife right here is wet. You don't see it, but it's wet. Water. That's why we have this towel right here. Now we just, now it's dry. And we put it away where all the big knives are. Which is over here. Down there. Right there. Well, in this room. But in your place, it's where we put the big knives. Boom, that's finished. Next up are pots and pans. And you know, you want pots and pans, you can make some mac and cheese or some green beans or mashed potatoes, you know? Some of the good meals and stuff. But right here, it's a pot. Don't look dumbfounded, I know what a pot is. I just didn't know if you knew what a pot was. So at the moment, it was wet, but now it's dry. And where do you put these? It's easy. In here. Yeah. Next up, plates and bowls. You know, they always go like up here somewhere. Right here? Got it. Yeah, we have cups. Cups, plates, and bowls. That's what we're doing with. Right here? It's a nice fine shot glass. You know, always gotta put it upside down. Gotta be that fancy self. You always gotta have that fancy side of yourself. And I have a lot of that fancy side. You got a bowl. Bowls go. With the set, you can never cut a set in half because that makes the set bad. Then we got these plates. Plates, you know, you always gotta be careful with plates because they're either glass or plastic and they are easily breakable. They're easily breakable. Boom. Now those plates are done and they're nice and clean. Now we only have one thing to do. The silverware. Can't start a day off with some silverware because who eats with their hands nowadays? Me. Yeah. I eat with my hands. Got a problem? Now with silverware, you always gotta be careful with silverware because you know, they're metal. And they can be easily broken by just bending them. Don't want that. You definitely don't want to go to the store and get more silverware because it's just expensive nowadays. Even though it's like 30 cents. Anyways, the silverware, you always got to put it where the other silverware is for like spoons. They go here. Not here. Not here. And definitely not in the bathroom because that's definitely not where the silverware go. There, I'm gonna do that again. Knives and forks. After your kitchen's all done, got no more dishes, no more food to make, you're all done. You have a space for yourself. Of course, there won't be any videos of showing you how to make dirty dishes because everyone knows how to make dirty dishes. Food, 
everyone, you gotta use dishes for food because you can't eat off the table or the floor. Even though we used to do that, we don't do it now because we're more, more upbeat. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to see anything else besides me doing dishes, you know what to do. Comment on this video. Then you got yourself another video that will be coming up. Whatever you want. But don't, don't, don't say anything dumb. Okay, I can already see you typing how to make blueberries because everyone knows how to make blueberries. You grow in the garden. Have a nice day. Stay toasty. See you next video.